her to capitalize on a counter-attack. So the French player plays a loose ball and the Irish player is able to pick up the ball and the first thing that he does really well here is he moves the ball ahead into a space and then accelerates into that space. So as he makes that intercept at the moment, he's in line with or slightly behind his defender over here and he uses his body to protect the ball, moves in quickly into that space. From there in his carry, you can see he's got a one-handed carry here just to try and keep some level of control on the ball, but he gets his eyes up to assess the situation. By assessing the situation, he can see his options that he has moving forward, where the defenders are. From here, he then angles his run to try and create a two-on-one situation. So he wants to pull this defender out wide. So by pulling it, you can see he's then adjusting. At this moment, he's holding inside. So we want to try and engage the defender, but if the defender holds, then we want to just keep going until he starts to engage and commits. Now you can see he starts to engage. As soon as the defender engages, he can then play a weighted pass ahead for the striker to run onto. So the timing of his pass here was really, really good. And he also plays it off the defender's left foot. It's very hard to defend off your left foot. So the pass that he plays into space is perfect good timing and then this player is then able to accelerate to get to the ball first and as he sees that the goalkeeper is coming out all right he's not going to be able to necessarily win that and beat him so the easiest and quickest way to get a shot on target and to beat the goalkeeper is a one touch lifted slap so you can see he gets nice and low gets underneath the ball and lifts it up over the right shoulder of the goalkeeper to beat him and scores a goal. So a fantastic way of how you can capitalize on a counter attack.